Welcome to Queen Deluxe. Let's do some spooky sewing. <laughs> Halloween is afoot. This week I'm working on my husband's costume for our Halloween weekend in Palm Springs. Let's put together the monster. That's right, we're heading to the Palm Springs Ukulele Festival and Halloween party. Here's a refresher of the sketch of the monster and the pattern I will be using. I have pre-cut all of the pieces and I'm ready to start stitching. Let's get our bobbin and machine threaded and then we're going to start with the shorts. The pattern has us start with the fly. I have basted the zipper in then stitch it down by machine. stitch under the zipper and then I lost the footage of the rest of the fly but we're moving on to flat felling at high speed. So all the seams on the shorts are flat felled. And if you would like a tutorial on flat felling seams let me know and maybe I can put that up in a couple weeks. up the shorts. Uh, it's the hem and the waistband. The hem is folded up at 5 eighths of an inch, top stitched at a sixteenth of an inch from the edge, and then folded under. what that final hem looks like, the flat felling, the side seams, and the beautiful fly. Now we're starting on the shirt, and it starts with the pockets. I'm putting a little orange pocket flap, which was harder to do than I would have, would have liked. The stretchy uh, fleece was a little difficult. Pressing and then we top stitch the pockets on. I did a double top stitch like so it would match the shorts. I decided to face the full front of the shirt so it would really look like the um, vintage ones. Here's the center front and neckline before the collar goes on bottom hem. This is the putting the sleeves together and hemming. Putting them into the shirt. Hemming the bottom and getting ready for buttonholes and collars.
thanks for doing some spooky sewing with me this week. Hope you had fun. I know I did. If you did have fun, give me a like. If you learned something, why don't you subscribe and share with a friend.